Welcome, 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 welcome. I'm laughing because uh, I'm using my my Apple computer um, laptop that I'm uh, YouTube upgraded. Um, and it's funny because I was just talking about it. And uh, first of all, welcome, 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 welcome. Okay. Um, but it's like it gives the countdown like three, two, one. Guys, I know nothing about Apple. Okay. Um, I'm not an Apple person. I even got Apple for my work phone and I, I don't use it. So first of all, I lost it. It's got to be around somewhere. I never put it on the tracking thing because I'm not an Apple person. Sorry. But guys, I just remembered people ask me all the time if I have FaceTime and I'm like, no, I'm pretty sure it's FaceTime. But I actually have it on the, the MacBook Air, whatever it's called, something like that. So it's on there. <laughs> So I guess I can do it. So we're going to do raw love, okay? Um, and there's a particular order that I'm going in today. We're starting with Leo, okay? Starting with the sun. Um, and um, I was going to move that, but you know what? I kind of feel like... I don't know. Intuitively, I want to tell you Wednesday is going to be good for you. Um, I don't know what that's all about. And it's not because it's sitting under Leo. It's just the first thing I, I was drawn to. Okay. So I'm not really sure if that's your day. Um, because they did want me to mention your color. All right. So I know your color are yellow and orange. So... Let's just see what we get from there, okay? And leave it at that. Um, so if you're having that type of, um, not necessarily difficulty, but um, questioning type thing, okay? Um, colors, I, I don't know, guys. I, I don't know. Um, but any whoosie. <sighs> Yellow and orange, okay? It is your is your deal. So... Let's do, let's do raw love. Um, let's see what we're looking at for you guys. I'm going to pull, I am going to pull a Ganesha card for each read. Um, you know what I'm feeling for you guys? My outdoor cards. So, let's do that. Let's do that. Is this recording? Yeah. So. Let me grab one of these. Okay. These cards are awesome. And I just got a huge whiff of my roses. And it's, I've been sitting here all morning. It's the first time I've, I've smelt them. So your senses are definitely on. Your senses are definitely kicking. All right. What do you got for us? Okay. Oh, apparently I gotta keep hitting that too. So you pulled the light, which is a three. All right, I'll read it. I will read it at the end. All right, but it's it's that what I was just talking about, like senses. You would, I'm sure it's not like a, a food thing or, but I'm not positive. Okay, I'm being blocked from it right now, which is bizarre. But there's that yellow, there's that sun, that aura of a Leo. But um, delight can be a delightful scent, a delightful taste, a delightful event. Okay, so considering it's roses. Um, it represented, you know, red roses is, is, is the love, so I'm not really sure where to go with that, guys, but man, is it, it it's, it's pretty, um, I was going to use the word fragrant, but that's not what I'm looking for. It, it's pretty intense the way, the way it, this smell is coming at me, and it's not even windy, and if you notice, my candle's kind of like going like... Well, I'm doing this now, but I've been looking at the leaves, 
and um, they're kind of like all over the place. The table, you know, it's not the shaky, it's, it's the smell coming at me. It's so bizarre. I don't know, I'm not going to argue with that. I know I sound like I'm all over the place because I literally just felt like I was. But there's a reason for that too. Don't you guys just love me? So any whoozy. We're already five minutes in and I've been yapping. Wow, that went by quick. I don't even remember what we were talking about. Alright, let's, let's go. What's going on with my babies? What's going on with my Leos? Um, let's see. What's going on with my little... I almost wanted to call you my little jelly beans. My little jelly beans. Okay, so... I got the Nine of Pence. Knight of Cups, Five of Wands, the Tower, the World. Something is most definitely completed, just something else to open, okay? Um, justice at the bottom of the deck, huh? All right, so let's see what this is all about. Confidence is good right now. Um, when you guys have tabo moments, they're difficult. Okay, they're not turbulent, but they're difficult. Um, when it comes to, say, an ending, all right, um, it's like, it's more difficult for you guys than it is, you know, harmonious. And I know it's like an ending court, really harmonious, but yeah, no, sometimes it can be, but there, it's difficult. And you're going to say to myself, you're going to say to yourself, like, court, all endings are difficult. Not necessarily Okay, it depends on what kind of ending this is for you. Um, but considering, you know, the two of them are by side by side, this this is a difficult ending. Why did the light dim? See, oh, dang apple, you guys are gonna have to work with me. Um, let me know if the the audio and the picture is clearer for you guys. This is why I did it. Okay. Um, I feel congratulations for you guys too when it comes to something. The confidence is there. It's 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 the difficult part. It, it's the it's the conflict. Uh, whatever ended just ended. It's the conflict. It, obviously, time was invested. There's no question that you invested time here. Um, to me, it looks like somebody shut somebody down. Okay, um, because in all reality. I gotta keep them a little slanted to me so I can kinda. Hey now, baby, get a good look. Um, but the tower would follow, okay? This is the confusing part because even though that would follow, it's like somebody might have possibly shut somebody down, or what it's telling me is that you are single. I don't know if you're dating, there's, you know, there's a couple options, there's competition, um, but it's also, do I want to invest my time in what this is? It looks like something completely wrapped up. It looks like comma, okay, because justice is here too, so at the bottom of the deck, so when, you know, it's, yeah, it's balancing out the scales, um, has to do with the relationship, you know, it's, it's the Libra, it's Venus, um, Considering it's under here and I'm looking, you know, because the Venus colors to, um, I mean, what Libras is green, purple, pink. And I see that purple, pink, you know, the green in the background, um, picking up on different things, guys. So this is definitely a relationship starting and ending or breaking up and, and taking care of you. Um, to me, it looks like you might possibly be dealing with a scorp but not necessarily. Um, but with Mars, where Mars is positioned right now in Pluto, 
it's that energy, okay? Um, and like I said, you know, Leos tend to have a, a difficult time with Scorp sometimes. So let's let's see. Let's see. Tell me about this Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups. Because to me, it's looking down. Like, do I invest time? Do I not? This ended. Do I start again? Something like that. So it's it's the devil. Okay. But to me, that's straight up. That's just Capricorn energy right now. It's that Saturn energy I was talking about. Cancerian. I mean, a Cancerian. You might be dealing with Cancerian. But it's like a comic wrap up. Um, I think the person coming in or going out was Cappy. Possibly. For some, for sure, okay. Um, it's also a, a bond. Um, this this is Capricorn. I don't even think this Cappy is angry. I, I just this speaks about this speaks about the bond that you have. It, it could have been a long time thing, you know. Um, And this is going to be your raw love. Sorry for the first half of January. Gosh, sorry guys. Um, these are going to come out as they come out. Um, I'm going to take my time with them. If one's shorter, one's longer, it is what it is. Okay, it's, it's a new year. So let's get to the bottom of it. Tell me about this devil. So to me, this is this is straight up cappy energy. All right, so you pulled guidance. So to me, this is, and it's going this way. It, it's being guided. Okay, um, I, I told you, like, it, I hate when I say I told you, I'm sorry. It, it's more, it's getting on your path, it's the new year, it's the year, the three. I don't, I don't know what that was, if you guys heard that. It sounded like straight up bubbles, like, like a, like bubbles, like a fish. Um, that was bizarre. So, this is being guided, put together, okay. Um, it looks like you've had tower moments with this person unless you're dealing with a scorp. Because now, do I invest time with this particular individual or not? Because this is what this is. And again, you got the another three with delight. So it definitely looks like whatever this is, is, is going to be quite a journey. I, I, to me, I do feel like it's your past. And look at that. I do feel like it's your past. Or a new soulmate coming in and you just don't know. Yeah, I think it's more of a past past. Do I apologize? Do I accept the apology? Um, tell me about this tower. Okay, so this looks like a, a, a new beginning if you ask me. This is this is not. I'm sad because it it would have gave me sad. Okay, this is happy. This is a new beginning with something. All right. So let me. Um, where is my pencil? <clears throat> I don't even feel like I bumped that. That's weird. Um, so let me just, um, where's my phone? I'm doing some doing some math um, you know, okay you have two twenty ones I'll tell you that right off the bat sixteen We got a three. So it's new math thing that's coming to me, guys. I, I have to roll with it. So <clears throat> OK, 
Okay, 77. Um, but, no, I'm not going to end up twisting. It's, it's my own thing, guys. If it was a different, if it was a different number, I'll break it down to you one day. I can't yet. It's kind of like a secret. As of right now, I just added all the numbers and it is that, but, um, I actually forgot to add that one. So this is all about your destiny. This is a new start. Um, letting doors shut. This has to do with money where you're going to invest your time. More or less, this is in a, re a relationship. You got two threes, you got two twenty ones. You know, it, it's the new year. It's a completion. Finish for my love. I am going to um, recap for you in a minute. You're going to have to have patience with me, guys. Because th they're sending me somewhere. It, it's new, and I, I have to adjust. Okay? Um, so... And it was a year ago today I started the channel. So you would figure, like, um, I figured it was going to be simple, smooth sailing. I was checking out the other videos, how they played out. Uh, I'm going to go back into that, um, what I labeled you guys is for the first time a year ago, you know. So those who have been with me from the beginning... Kind of, I want to see where you were at, but it's funny with the delight. I didn't realize I like this card so much. Look at how I <laughs> there's certain ones I, I really, really liked. So let's see what it's all about. It says, We born, we're born with the gift of laughter. Laughter is natural medicine. Laughter can be helpful in ways that you may not even realize or imagine. The simple laugh can help you feel better about yourself or the world around you. If you're looking at a situation too seriously, try to find the humor in it. This will, this will help you. Be centered, okay? It will help you stay centered, too, and be grateful for what you have. Laughter can be a natural diversion and can help you break up stagnant energy. When you laugh, no other thoughts come to mind. Laughing is a physical change of the body. After sharing some laughs along friends, among friends, after a few minutes, you're going to feel better for hours. So a few minutes of laughter can make you feel better for hours, okay? Laughter and humor is such an amazing energy. It's a good belly rumble, despite the stale negative energy that you might be feeling, okay? You have a higher purpose here. You gotta look at something in a different perspective. If you want more pep and humor in your life, ask to work with Ganesha, ask him to support yourself, your, your joys, and your new ways of thinking. There are, actual, there are actually some stories of the Ganesha, the born from sugar shivers laughter. Ask Ganesha to help you lighten up through laughter. Do so and receive this immeasurable benefit by having more lighthearted approach when things come your way. You also feel healthier. Laughter really is the best medicine. Live, laugh, love. That's what I wrote. So to me, that was my live, laugh, love. Okay. That apparently I, that's what I picked up in that. So it it is delight. It is new things. It is new love, guys. It, whether it's whether it's new or old, I'm feeling old for some. Whatever it is, it's being. It looks to be guided together. You do got new love here. You do got this. This is Capricorn energy, which is long-term energy, guys. It's being guided to come together, okay? Um, I don't know why that just came on. But I'm going to go to my gallery real quick. And I am going to look at my screenshots and what my Leos were a year ago. So, do not repeat the cycle. That's what I was a year ago, okay? So it looks like finally something came to an end. And if it's with the same person and it's coming back around, that old cycle is done. It is something brand new. Obviously, lots of lessons were learned, okay? I'm going to pull a lesson card, but the lesson that you should have learned in the last year. And I'm doing the year. I'm, I'm, I'm going back. It's actually 11 months, which talks about getting on your path, even though it was a year ago today. Um, I, I had it for 11 it was 11 months for some reason. It was my first raw loves, okay, is what I'm going back to. So it's it's all about that new path, that creativity, getting going, all right? This is most definitely guided. Your biggest lesson for 2018 was worry. So that's a long time, all right? So, you know, it was balance and, and worrying about outcomes. And I'm telling you right now, 
this is what what Saturn being here in these karmic lessons and and Cappy's ruled by Saturn too. Okay, so that's quite the lessons that you've experienced and went through. So it looks like to me you conquered worry, you conquered outcomes. You you conquered how to balance yourself. What did they conquer in the last year? What did they conquer in the last year? My Leos, what did they conquer? Guilty, guilty feeling. It, it was growing. So in the last year, your soul has really, really grown. You also went through endings. Okay. So your lesson for January 2019. Your lesson for January 2019. To me, definitely do not repeat this cycle. Okay. Because we do have an eight, a total for when I break down numerology. Okay. So, as for January, you know, forgiving, and I told you for some, this does look like somebody needs to apologize, vice versa. Something did completely end, but for something to start brand new again, okay? So, if this is the past, it's more or less, to me, kind of like, go with the flow, invest the time, if you feel it's worth investing, try to try to nip this in the butt, the, the conflict, okay? Um... Can I have the best advice for conflict, please? Best advice for the five of wands. And, you know, it looks like you might want to invest some time. All right? It, it's just, it's the lovers. It's, you pulled schizophrenia, too. So, to me, it's just, it's the nutty. It's the whole, I saw that earlier, too, when I split the deck with these actually exact two. That's ironic. So, that's a big message, ladies and gents. Um, the wind blows. And it's also an eight. Together, it's an eight. Okay? So, yeah, two 21s, two eights, two threes. This is being guided. There's love here. There's a strong bond. But we talked about that with the devil. We we know that. Okay? Don't, do not drive yourself nuts. Okay? Go with the flow. Learn to go with the flow. Apologize. Accept somebody's apology if necessary. But your best advice for this, for this five of wands is, it, it's not, it's not a choice here. Okay, it it is a lover. It is a strong bond. Um, so it, it's conflict. It's straight up conflict and worry. Try to, you know, like who saw that whole. That whole thing, because that seems to be the biggest thing here, is is the conflict and worry in the next two weeks when it comes to this this lover. Whether it's brand new or the past, either way, it, it's brand new lover on the board. They're going to come in new, or it is going to be brand new. So, yeah, best advice for this whole thing, you know, and, and that includes the worry, all of that. Best advice for Leo, because... You know, it, it is about getting on your purpose. And actually, you would have 777, to be honest with you, because originally it was the 77, and there's that 7. Will you invest time? This is getting on your purpose and going. Don't look back. Let whatever shut, shut. Let bygones be bygones. It is, it is going to present itself. And it is a very strong bond. Best advice for my Leos. The dreamer, you know, it's, it's like the fool, zero. That leap of faith, follow your dreams, unexpected opportunities coming. Take a leap of faith. Take a leap of faith. And at the bottom of the deck, you got renewal, which is a two. Okay? It's, it's, a, favorable, it's a favorable something going in your direction. And it's also a brand new direction. Getting on your journey, getting on your path, taking a leap of faith, trusting in yourself, trusting in the universe, trusting this other person. Talking about what needs to be talked about. Hashing things out that need to be hashed out. Because there's love here. Lessons were learned. There has been growth. For this particular scenario. But I'm going to tell you. Don't forget. This is. It was just 2444. Four, four. This is a difficult scenario. Okay. I, I, I do know that. That this is difficult. So push through. In the next couple weeks. Okay. But. Your best advice was take a leap of faith. All right. All right, my little lions. Um, 
I do want to find out the world real quick. Tell me about the world. To me, it's you wrapped up a, a horrible moment with a certain situation ship. All right, but it definitely, this is definitely improvement coming. Yeah, lots of love. All right. Whatever was wrapped up before is definitely coming back around. So even, like I said, even if it's the it's it's brand new and not the past, it, it's the emotions. It's still stuff that's going to be triggered. This is always brand new. And this is a bond that you have with somebody. It's being guided, my little Leos. It can be delightful. Don't forget that's your overall message too, is delight that comes out of this. The smell of roses, the smell of the flower, okay? If you need color around you, you know, I know you're stressed out with the song that's on because it, it just brought me straight to the song, which would make sense, stressed out with the schizo, schizophrenia. But the yellows and the orange, oranges, okay? Um, eat some oranges, extra vitamin C for you guys. And I didn't say that because of an orange. It, it literally just popped out. Um, get that extra vitamin C. Okay. Make sure you take time for yourself. Exercise would be really good for you guys this year, okay? Um, especially outside, especially running. You guys like to run, you know. You are vulnerable when you guys are stressed out, so don't read too much into that, all right? You're, you tend to, when you're satisfied, you're satisfied, you know, so... Don't forget, you know, my Leos, you're friendly, you're warm, you're ambitious. Don't forget all the great qualities that you own. All right. Um, I'm, I'm feeling performance, so I'm not really sure where you're heading. Maybe it will come out in, in the end of January, early February. There's some type of performance here. You know, a little bit of traffic. Oh, I hear that name again. I hear that. Mm -mm, what is that? That is so weird. Is that my phone? All right, that's my phone. But that was not the bubble sound I heard earlier. And besides, it was over there. Any hoozy, I love you guys. Um, vitamins. I, I just picked up a piece of hair, and it's weird. Now you got the all four sevens. Um, those who lose your hair a lot in the tub, try vitamins to strengthen it or vitamin a certain vitamin shampoo. Um, I don't know what that's all about, but don't, don't panic. I feel like you're getting blood work, stuff like that, but, um, I got the goosebumps, so that's happening to some of you, but, like, it's, it's the lack of vitamins. Even if you eat well, there's a certain vitamin, all right, your metabolism's just, like, chewing it up, it's doing something, it's, it needs, to, it needs to be with something else to keep it in your system, if that makes sense. I, probably not, because I'm not a nurse, I'm not a doctor, I'm not a nutritionist, but that's what I'm being, that's what I'm kind of being told, even though I don't hear them. It's, it's channeling, guys, I can't explain it. I can't explain it. But, I love you guys. Take a leap of faith. I, I know you're in a difficult situation, I know you're worried, some need to forgive, things are going to be triggered, but in all reality, there's, there's love here, things end and start for a reason, let the door shut, it, it, honestly, let it shut to have this brand new beginning, alright, this person's bringing love, it's going to be up to you whether or not you're going to want to invest time in this situation, but to, I, I would say go for it, okay, live, laugh, love, don't forget the Hoganesha main message with the leap of faith okay so and this is looking right at you so yeah it is going to be a little bit of a challenge but we already discussed that it's not like it's going to be turbulent i don't see you dealing with um i don't really see pisces on my board at all i mean that could be not pisces i'm looking at major arcana for you guys this week um, Cappy can be turbulent for you guys, but I'm telling you, this is, this is being guided. This is a long-term scenario. It's, it's out with the old, in with the new. It's a lesson. Okay. So I love you guys so much. Is, so much is. Don't, don't repeat the cycle. There was something I read somewhere about repeating a cycle. I don't know if it was that one, but, you know, 11 months from today, because today, it's, it's a year, guys, and I, I was drawn to go to my very first Raw Loves, and it was, I believe it was just, don't repeat the cycle. So, 
what this is saying is it, it whatever situation ship you were in then that might be the one coming back around okay um so that's a big message for somebody because i'm being guided to go back all right so for somebody if it is the same person it is time to look at it differently react differently talk differently compromise okay I love you guys so much. Have a great day. Bye, guys. And if somebody's insecure, don't, because I'm in love with your body. A lot of things are being triggered right now. Don't panic. Breathe. Breathe through it. I love you guys. Bye.